man that has survived for the grace of God things that we can never imagine and he gets up and he says fight 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 I happen to be honored today surrounded by representative of God on earth and we have to pray yes. and I always would say pray 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 but fight <laughs> fight fight because that's exactly what we need to do praying itself is not gonna do it we need to pray and fight now talking about the economy this is very simple you made us energy independent in just a flick of a finger that's right. you can do it again now here's the problem. We have people running our country who are totally economic illiterate. These people have never had a job. These people have never run a business. These people have never signed the front of a check. Mr. Donald Trump has done all of that and he runs the con this country like a business because after all it's a business. You cannot keep printing money that you don't have to help people who hate you instead of taking care of your own neighbors here in America. That's why he will make America great again. And when he makes America great again, he will make the whole world great again. Because we need to be strong enough to take care of our problem and then we can go and help the people who need help. So thank you, Mr. President. Talking about the American dream, a young boy came to this country at age 13, didn't even know the language, and one day he's sitting in a panel <laughs> hugging the best man, the President of the United States of America. Thank you very much from the bottom thank of you my heart. Much.